Jim Bob Duggar's sister Deanna slammed him and his disgraced son Josh in a shady deleted post on Monday. The 59-year-old called out her family members ahead of Josh's prison sentencing next month but later decided to get rid of the negative note she'd written. On her Instagram feed, Deanna shared a smiling selfie with a less-than-happy caption. She blasted her brother Jim Bob and her nephew Josh in the post, though decided she didn't want to give their names any space on her page. In the original caption, which has since been deleted but was captured by fans on Reddit, she wrote, I was told a completely different story about a certain family member. I saw the truth on my local news. So sad. Counting on fans commented to say that they know the family member is Josh and that she should just say Josh, one of the many assuming the person lying to Deanna had been her brother wondered, how does JB lie and lie and not get specifically called out, as Josh was found guilty on two charges of CP months ago and his sentencing isn't until next month, Redditors noted there doesn't he appear to be anything new, she's just way late to slam her family. After posting the photo and caption, Deanna later decided to scrap the message and replace it with a more positive one. She wrote, I am just counting my blessings today. What are you thankful for? Her followers were confused by the switch up and asked her for clarification in the comments. Yes, I did change the post, Jim Bob's sister admitted. I did not think there was anything wrong with changing it, the 59-year-old continued, I thought I had freedom on my Instagram to post things I want to. I decided to make it positive, he faces up to 20 years in prison on each count. Beverly Hills attorney Adam Michael Sachs exclusively told The Sun that he believes the father of seven will get the maximum sentence in the range due to his celebrity status. The lawyer, who specializes in family and criminal law, said, the judge doesn't have a lot of discretion because of the formula used for sentencing. If the judge feels like he's worth saving, he'll go towards the lower end of the range. If Josh has a bad attitude in court or if he is influenced by victim statements, he'll aim for the higher range, the attorney continued. For Josh, I believe he will get a higher sentence. Courts don't want to deal with being accused of giving special treatment and just giving a slap on the wrist. The judge might say, people looked up to you. You were on television. You should have been a better example for the people who watched you.